Hi everyone, this is Killshot from 9 to 9 Gaming doing a video for The Walking Dead Road to Survival. And this is best three-star rare character. So I want to continue the best of the best series. And it is going to take a little bit of a turn over the next couple of days. But I definitely want to talk a little bit about rarity in the first couple of videos. we got the five-star choices out there. we got the four-star. The three-star is really going to... You guys are going to have to think back. A lot of you from when you first started playing the game. Some of you are probably going to say there aren't even a good three-star anymore because you've gotten so used to four-stars and five-stars. However, what we're looking for a little bit to create the dialogue and the debate... I remember there's some new players watching this and which characters, you know, if you guys are using all fives and fours, I get it. But if you had to recommend a three-star character to a new player, uh, what kind of characters would you uh, would you throw out there? I've got a little bit of experience with this because, believe me, I've done a lot of pack openings and got a lot of three-stars. Probably got more three-stars than anybody else in the game. So uh, here's a few of the ones that I put up there and we'll talk about a little bit. So three-star Andrea, someone said, look, all Andreas are OP. So let's take a quick look. You can see she's got a steady shot, 350% damage to one enemy, and she also gets that uh, crit boost for a teammate. So pretty solid if uh, you're in a pinch and you know you want a character you're just starting out. Andrea's solid, and she can also be used to uh, some stronger teams as well too. If you've got four-star teams or one five-star and a few four-stars, throw her in there. Someone mentioned Gavin to me, and I've never really paid attention to Gavin. I always send him directly to the Supply Depot. So honestly... I, don't, I hadn't paid a lot of attention. So let's um, take a look at his pillar of leadership. All teammates get 80% defense for two turns, and all ranged teammates get 20% attack. I could see this. I could see this on a nice defensive team. You throw him in there and um, you know leave him overnight and have your defense beefed up a little bit more if you don't have any other defensive characters. So I could see Gavin with a little bit of consideration there. Let's take a look at three-star Shane. I've never really done a lot with uh, green Shane. So uh, it's got a backstab, 350% damage to one enemy. All teammates get 20% attack against melee. So he's kind of, you know, niche type of character, but, um, you know, pretty decent adrenaline rush there. So let's take a look at Axel. Axel has been on several of my teams. I don't know if it's because he's not that good, but he is yellow, and I didn't have a, look, a lot of good yellow characters in the beginning. You can see crack those joints, 180% damage, minus 20% attack. All melee get a small uh, bonus there. So, yeah, I mean, if you don't have anybody else, Axel is definitely a possibility. Dale is going to get one of my votes because I've used Dale for a long time. I still use Dale. I mean, he was my first real healer. You can see teammates 60% of their max HP recover from attack penalties. I've never used him as a leader, but he's definitely been a great support healer. Um, and he's got a nice little beer belly there too, and definitely a cool little uh, fishing hat. So, you know, how can you not vote for Dale? Dale, good stuff there. Let's take a look at a few other characters. Uh, come on, guys. You know I'm not going to do a video without putting at least a couple Ricks up there for debate. So here's three-star Rick, a new beginning. How many times have you guys seen this in pack openings? 50. All teammates get 40% defense for two turns. Uh, this has been kind of like my, you know, my buff. Uh, this wasn't quite baby Rick. This is kind of like baby Rick's brother. All range teammates, 15%. Never really used him as a leader. But uh, here you go. Let's take a look at baby Rick. So baby Rick, all support teammates, 40% of their max uh, health points. So I've used him a lot, obviously, in combination with Dale at one-two punch. Uh, you know, just a couple healers. This isn't the one I leveled up. This is the one that's probably going to end up going to the Supply Depot because I've had multiple of them. But, um, you know, you can definitely see three-star Rick. Pretty decent support character. Give you some good off heals. Um, the next three are probably debate these three because I think all three of them are awesome. Dr. Stevens. Dr. Stevens is still on my yellow team. Uh, definitely have uh, Molly now, but, but this guy, 60% of your max health. I uh, haven't used him as a leader. You could if you had to, but he's been a strong healer for my yellow teams for a long time. Let's take a look at Sophia. Sophia is pretty new. All teammates get 30% crit, and she's low level, but she's got that specialist ability. So, um, you know, there's your walker boost right there. I threw her on my walker team, and she did pretty well for a short period of time. And the last one I'm going to take a look at, uh, this is probably, I think, this might be the first character I ever maxed out with uh, Tier 3. So you can see Michonne, how it's done, 350% uh, damage. Now, I still haven't maxed out her Adrenaline Rush, but I did max her Tier 3, level 50. Uh, all melee teammates get uh, plus 16 crit. I've used her as a leader. I've used her. She has a very strong Adrenaline Rush. Uh, she hits hard. So, um, you know, just something to keep in mind. If there's some other characters out there you guys would like to debate and discuss, leave them in the comments below. Definitely want to create some dialogue and hear your opinions. Uh, just so we can create a nice big argument with everybody. Thanks for watching. My name is Killshot. Give this video a thumbs up. And there will be a rant coming soon. There's going to be some Telltale stuff coming soon. 
and uh, a whole lot of other stuff tonight. Just uh, watch everything. Give me a lot of thumbs up. Peace.